we separated for a while um, and lived life without each other. And I think that that made us have more of a, an appreciation for who the other person was and have a different outlook on getting back together. How do you feel about people kind of, you know, getting an inside glimpse into your marriage? I, I don't really like it. I mean, <laughs> it's we've had a challenging relationship and so people can be very judgmental. You know, a lot of people have reached out and said, oh, you deserve better. How do you let them treat you that way? This, but they don't know, you know, they're not in the day to day. They don't know the history and the, your day to day life. So I'm almost, I'm almost like a little bit of like defend, like want to defend him, you know? Yeah. But at the same time, I can see, yeah, there are part, there are definitely time periods of our life where I would like to have him be more supportive. And it was, it was some, some of the stuff was pretty embarrassing, right? That like your husband would treat you that way. Right. So I felt, I felt humiliated at times and that was probably the hardest part. Yeah. I mean, yeah, I would imagine. I mean, would you say that that was the root of the problem? What you guys were going through was that he wasn't being supportive of you. And was he supportive of you going on the show? The root of the problem probably is us respecting each other Mm -hmm. and being supportive of one another on both ends. I probably require a little bit more support than he does, but nonetheless, you know, supporting each other. Mm -hmm. And was he supportive of me going on the show? He was 100% supportive of me going on the show. Um, I think he knows himself pretty well and he knows that he's, you know, an introverted person. So he, that's not his cup of tea, but knowing Ryan and knowing how quiet he can be, I thought he actually did a really good job. Yeah. Like, I, I, I mean, he even does a confessional. Right. I was like, that's so good. We've come so far. Look how far we've come. <laughs> you're literally running away from cameras and now you're like in the studio. <laughs> right. Yeah. Um, I know in an upcoming episode, it teases that Ryan actually leaves for a little bit. Can you tell me a little bit about that and where your marriage was at that point? I mean, I think that was the beginning of the, uh, you know, the, the, the beginning of the, the like, end, I guess you could say, because throughout the season and throughout our lives, you know, he's, He's becoming more dismissive, more dismissive, more distant. And it just reaches a breaking point where you're like, I mean, he just runs runs away. Mm-hmm. And um, again, you're, I, I was put in a place where I felt very humiliated and abandoned and all and things that I don't want to feel. But <clears throat> coming back and, and it got worse. So that, that happened and it kept getting worse and worse and worse. But then it came back around in the end. So... And maybe that ha- that had to happen for us to, you know, actually start changing things. That's both, like for us both to want to start changing things. Sure. And how did you kind of get back to where you are right now? We we separated for a while and lived life without each other. And I think that that made us have more of a, an appreciation for who the other person was and have a different outlook on getting back together and and putting in the work to stay together. Yeah, definitely. How long were you separated for? For a month. Yeah. Yeah. And how, who was supporting you out of the castmates who was supporting you during that time? So that was post filming. And I mean, Heather was still being very supportive. I talked to her outside of filming. It was, I talked to some of the girls, but she was very supportive of that. It was so intense though. I wasn't really talking to many people. I was just trying to get through it. (laughs) It was pretty intense. Would you say that the show put a strain on your marriage or would you say the show actually opened up like a magnifying glass into what was going wrong in your marriage? Um, I would say that the show put a magnifying glass on what was going on in our marriage that we had ignored for so many years when both of us were not happy. And then when you have, you know, a magnifying glass and 20 cameras on you, 30 cameras on you, you're forced to look at it, right? You're forced to either come together or walk away. Mm -hmm. And so we walked away and then came together. We did both. (laughs) 